Day one, baby, Kellington. Hey everybody, it's Hallie O'Brien and welcome to the Snow Report presented by Ski Magazine where we talk skiing, snowboarding, gear, beer, and every episode is a guaranteed good time. I've got a big beanie on and I'm drinking a pumpkin beer. I don't know what season it is. I don't even know what time it is. Daylight saving time? All I know is this guy wants to speed fall along in a big way. He's on the top of a roof with a leaf blower, proactively blowing the leaves off of the tree. <laughs> I think he's a skier. I think he's a skier and he's trying to hurry things along. Or maybe he's just sick of leaf peepers driving slowly past his house. Oh yeah, you wanna take that picture? Put your cameras away. How's this for a plot twist? That's not his tree. The ski season has officially begun on the East Coast. That's right, Killington Resort in Vermont opened on Sunday, somewhere around 10 a.m. It's making them the first to open in the East. What's that? No way. Well, as it happens, another ski area opened on Sunday, only it was two hours earlier, Catalucci Ski Area in North Carolina. Opened on Sunday at 8.30 a.m. Making them the first to open and the Arapaho Basin of the East. <laughs> Geez, this race to open has been ruthless. Between Keystone and A-Basin, Catalucci and Killington, I don't know which way is up. All I know is ski season has begun. Okay, let's check in with open snow to get this week's forecast. <laughs> According to Sam Collentine, October brought well above average snow to most of the Rockies. Looking ahead through early November, the atmosphere is going to make a change with the best chance for snow heading to Western Canada, Montana, the upper Midwest and the Northeast. As always, head over to opensnow.com or download their mobile app so you can get up-to-date forecasts for your favorite resorts. Have you forgotten what winter is all about? Is your stoke level not where it should be? Fear not, friends, because our buddies at the Mountain Collective have our back. That's right, they just shared this really great compilation of all things winter that you need to see. We're gonna watch it together. Okay, pause real fast right here. Let's take a screenshot of this. Could you imagine being in the front seat of that thing? Ooh, that's enough to give you the heebie-jeebies. <laughs> okay, sorry, me again, real quick. Um, did you hear that? <laughs> Wee! <laughs> sorry, okay, I, I'm, I'm 12. Okay, one final interruption. This time I just have to point out that that's a snowboarder spraying another snowboarder. If this were a snowboarder on skier offense, oh my God, we'd never hear the end of it. <laughs> thank you, Mountain Collective. That was great. Was it good for you? Mountain Collective, thank you for the reminder and for giving us something to aspire to. And uh, if your stoke level lasts more than four hours after watching that, cheers, that's the point. All right, that's all we've got for you this week. If you like this show, click that like button, share it around to a friend who will like it too, and in the comments below, let me know. What are you most excited for this season? I'm Hallie O'Brien. This is The Snow Report Show. Thanks so much for watching, and I will see you next week. Ow. <laughs> this beanie sheds pretty badly. It's like a, like a Siberian husky for the scalp. And hey, if your stoke level lasts more than four hours, that's the point. Ow. <laughs>